So, hey guys, I just then pretty much found out a couple of, like, hours ago, one of my favorite actors from the new, latest Star Wars movie by Mendelssohn, from Rogue One, is going to be in them, the new Robin Hood movie as Sheriff Nottingham, I'm pretty sure, which I think is going to be just fabulous. It's like, he's an Australian actor, for those of you guys not knowing, and, like, he can even do Canadian accents, I'm pretty sure he can pull off a British accent as well. Not too much like if you've seen him on Bloodline or just his um accent as a famous Australian actor, of course. Then, like, pretty much it will kind of sounds as well. Like, he's, like, in the UK or whatever setting. Because I'm pretty sure that's what Robin Hood was. And it's going to be, like, out next year. Which I'm so excited for, like, with him. Taryn Edgerton, I think, from... Um, the Kingsman movies as Robin Hood, like a teenage younger movie, unless they like, do something like put hair extensions. Jamie Foxx from like Ray and Annie and stuff. Um, Fifty Shades of Grey's Christian Grey is gonna be all Scarlet. Oh yeah, Jamie Foxx is Little John. There's a girl I think from like Game of Thrones, I believe, or Bridges of Spies that's gonna be made Marianne. And yeah. Probably a bunch of other people since it will probably be around April or maybe even 2018 because I know that Ben's, I think, now currently working on this movie called Ready Player One, which is going to be directed by Steven Spielberg, starring one of Spielberg's co-stars, Mark Rylance from Bridges of Spies. That's going to be out, like, 2018, but I think they're, like, filming some of it now. But maybe they're filming Robin Hood right now. And then maybe, like, summertime it may get pushed to a release date. Because, like, I'm trying to think of what the trailer is called. But, like, I know that... I forget what the, um, the title is called, not the trailer. But maybe the trailer will come out soon, like, they probably... Writing the scripts and like thinking, who else could be them? Especially like, if you guys are familiar with the story, Robin Hood had like several merry men who helped him fight Sheriff Nottingham. Like there was a Maparadori or whatever a couple of years back, or like in the nineteen eighties, where sorry, <laughs> where there is Nottingham instead of Nottingham. So yeah, and like whatever else they decide to add to the stories. Since I'm, like, a big gigantic fan of Robin Hood, like, I used to have a crush on Kevin Costner, who was Robin Hood in, like, 1991. So, like, yeah. And, like, of course, like, he has famous dad and a bunch of fighting scenes. Plus, it'll be interesting, because I think Taron is either in his late 20s or 30s. And Ben is 48 in April, so 47 in a bit. So that'd be quite interesting, like an age difference type thing. But then again, I'm sure it's happened before, right? Like, if you were to um, compare one of my favorite movies, Star Wars, which Ben actually is in, if you guys did not get that part, but I don't know how old James Earl Jones was or whoever plays Darth Vader, but I think Mark Hamill was, like, maybe my age, 23, in um, episode 5, because I think he was... In his early 20s, I'm pretty sure, when he began Star Wars, which was 1977. But, like, yeah. And I'm a super excited Star Wars fan. Like, I'm going to go see Rogue One with Ben and it next, uh, this Tuesday coming up, which I'm, like, so excited. My friend got me on my Star Wars t-shirt. Like, yeah. From, like, episode 7, but I don't really care. Unless I go out shopping to the mall, like, on Sunday or Monday, and then I'll probably go try to find a Rogue one. Because I'm, like, super excited. And maybe I'll do, like, a reaction to, like, that one. Maybe in a bit. I don't know. My boyfriend's going to call me in a couple of minutes or so. And my phone's going to text me. But maybe I'll do, like, a quick Rogue One reaction thingy, like, stuff that I may want to see in it. Or, like, may want to find out like if you guys are big 
Star Wars fans, then, like, and you guys have seen episode 7, it's rumored that some of the characters from Rogue One could, like, end up being related to characters. But, like, yeah. Like, for example, um, Mods Mickelson's Galen Erso could be Lord Santeca Maxima and Sido. From episode 7, if you guys have seen him. Because it's obvious, somehow, um, Lord Santeca knows Leia and Han. Because I think she mentioned Leia. She, he probably mentioned Han, though, too. I'm trying to remember. But, like, yeah. And I used to have a crush on Harris and Floyd like crazy now. Ben's mine from this one. Um, Donald Glover, who's the new Lando Clarison, is pretty cute too. I may go see him in um, oh my God, Spider Man Homecoming because like I used to love Michael Keaton. The new Spider Man actor is kind of cute too. But like, so maybe I'll do like a reaction type thing in a couple of weeks or so. If, like, they even release episode eight's trailer, like, what I think is going to happen. And, you know, everything like that. Maybe, like, everybody's doing, I'll do, like, a fan theory as well. Maybe, like, who's Ray's dad. Or, whatever. Actually, yeah, that's probably going to be my next video. Maybe at, like, 8 p.m. or something tonight. Because it is 6.44 p.m. here so I'm gonna like let my phone charge a little bit call my boyfriend at 7 30 and then maybe I'll do like another video maybe not this that long but yeah <clears throat> and maybe one day I'll do like an ask questions type segment type thing like ask questions and just like talk for a bit or whatever oh, yeah. and since I like love talking a lot feel free to like share my videos subscribe if you guys haven't I do a um, movie reviews and everything, just like hit my belt section. But yeah, it's most likely it's mostly like movie reviews or something. And maybe one day I'll do a top ten of like a certain celebrity for you guys, like a slideshow, or just like write down a list in no particular order. Okay, like just like write down some of my favorite celebrities on a piece of paper or whatever first. Until I get, like, more people involved. Or maybe, like, if me and my friends... Like, I don't have, like, that many, like, friends or whatever. Like, I do, but, like... Not, like, any YouTuber type ones that do the same stuff like me. Like, movie reviews and stuff. But maybe, like, we'll do, like, a ton... Like... I don't know. Maybe I'll, like, Skype them or whatever and put them, like, them on Skype. Whatever. Like, on my phone. And then we can probably, like, do, like, a Skype type broadcast like hold the phone or whatever on the video thingy so that they can like see you guys or whatever and then we all like do a top whatever sort of like my favorite um youtube channel called skull me knows slash um collider they do different movie reviews that's how i found out about ben a little bit earlier and that rogue one's gonna be super popular so maybe we'll do something like that, like they do a top 10s usually on like Wednesdays, I think, or today, I think it's supposed to be a top 10. But like, yeah, and like, there's like news channels, whenever a certain celebrity's movie comes out, like I think last week or something it was Tom Cruise, maybe just because of like The Mummy coming out and Jack Reacher too. But yeah, maybe, we'll do, maybe I'll do like a forest Whitaker segment thingy like write down some of his movies that I've seen or like a top something of, the, of his movies and just like randomly explain probably why I like them and that's what I'm going to do for the time being for a little bit maybe but yeah so I'll see you guys in a bit maybe maybe tomorrow actually Okay, bye guys. Please like, comment, subscribe, share, whatever. Bye.